Melis? I don't want you to get stuck up there. They're having issues with this. No, and I really do want... Go for it. Why are you filming? That one's good. That's good. The other one... I think you should come down. It's filming you coming down. It's kind of weird. Everybody, I'm Kelly and I'm Melissa and we're outside of an estate sale and uh, you said that there's like hundred and sixty photos of Something everything like that. that's in there yeah and there's tons of cars so we're gonna take you inside and let's see what we can find Pretty interesting. Quarter each. Yeah, it is. I go into the kitchen and you can see something in the frame here but I don't actually see it the first time around, but I definitely come back to it. I also missed something else in this frame. Oh, is there? Uh -huh. Okay, I'm coming. Melissa pointed out that they have a lot of Christmas items. I do like these little vintage plates. And so I decided to pick those two up some cool Christmas Christmas oh, ornaments yeah. but they do look pretty beat up yeah I appreciate that I have a few things in my hand and I asked for a box I grab um, that yeah. sure that's perfect appreciate that yeah thank okay. you now, is the leather chair for sale? Like that, yeah. The leather chair? This one? Yeah. Let me just take this one. I think it was one. I'm not sure. I don't think it is. No. Oh. An old copy of the bell jar. I've never read it and have wanted to, so I decided to pick that up for myself. Some photos of the family at a winery. Love these old photos, getting to see the people who lived in these houses. Hey, hey. Yeah, I have some things out there. I spot this salt pottery and I like the painting on it of the woman's face and it's 15. I figure if we get a bunch of other items, they'll probably bundle it and it'll drop the price. So I decide to take that. There's the item that I keep missing every time I come in here. And I even pick something up next to it and I still don't see it. And it's something we've sold for over a hundred dollars in the past. Can you keep an eye out? <laughs> Crazy. Go ahead. All right, you good? All right, uh, going up. If there's room, I'll go up to oh, I'll I'll wait seven people you up there. Go on. No oh, problem. really? Yeah, oh, all right. Just go. Yeah, I'm going out. Do it. Oh, okay. Are you so they have an attic full of things, and Melissa's figuring out how to get up there. Uh, but they have to actually close you up Four in there minutes. because you can't get around it to get to the other door. No, I'm going to keep this for winter dinner. Ha ha. <laughs> shortages up before because it's going to be good. Fresh meat. Ha ha. People are eating people. That's what they didn't eat. Yeah. They got a little love, they ate their children. All right. Oh, people. 
go. Four more victims. <laughs> I jump into this other room to see, and I do spot a coach bag. So I pick it up to look at it later. I see some wool sweaters in a pile. Good time, Charlie. Book about a cat. Looks pretty fun. I decided to pick that up. I spot some wool sweaters. This one's Pendleton. Um, it does look like it has some issues. Maybe some uh, moths got to it. So I decided to pass on that one. This one looks nice, this Pendleton. Really, it's it's in really good condition. I decided to get that. And then this L.L. Bean, 100% Shetland wool. And I grabbed that. This polo shirt looks nice. Looks like it's probably vintage, so I grabbed that. And here I am back in the kitchen. And let's see. I'm looking at some cookbooks here. I do like the vintage cookbooks. And the second time through, I do see it. It's a James Beard cookbook from the 1950s. And it's got these just incredible illustrations. I don't look it up because I, I just love it. And I figure if it's not worth much money, I'll keep it for myself. I like these coasters, napkins. Unfortunately, the Halloween ones were in, not in great shape, so I pass on those, but I do pick up those Santa ones. I do run my hand over it to make sure it doesn't have chips. Um, Unfortunately, I get it home and I find out that it does have chips on it. So that was a kind of a disappointment there. Just putting those in my box in the cookbook. There we go. I pick up the brawn. I finally see it. Third time's a charm. And I open it up and it looks like it's never been used. It has the plastic around it still and the instructions. We've sold another one of these for $120 and it went really fast. I'm super excited about that find. Melissa, are you still up there? Melissa? Yes. And this is where the heckling gets kind of crazy. Good job. Who wants to come down? You can only come down if you bought something. Melissa's looking upstairs in the attic at things. Melissa? I see somebody. Okay, just check in. Melissa, I don't want you to get stuck up there. They're having issues with this. Shh. No, and I um, really do want... Go for it. Why are you filming? Oh, oh, oh. That one's good. Huh? That one's good. The other one. I think you should come down. Oh, no, I'm good. Now we're good. Okay, there you go. That's what it was. No, we're good. Can I come down now, though? Yeah. <laughs> no. She was filming you coming down. It's kind of weird. This is really cute. I thought that might be. Oh, it's it's a vintage. Oh, that's really adorable. Look at this. Vermont Originals, 100% wool. I think there's a spot on it though. Let me see. And it's a dry clean only sort of situation. So I maybe. wouldn't. I don't know. I don't. I it's wouldn't. It's a cool sweater. Though. It is, but it has a stain. Super worn out, but it's also very soft and very old. Okay. Jersey CIA. Oh wow. That's cool. Yeah. I didn't know about these. We haven't had a ton of luck with these windbreakers. Windbreakers, but I yeah. can't resist looking at the vintage windbreaker. Mm -mm. No. No, I'd skip it. Well, we'll put these in that room with the um, Yeah, yeah, just putting it aside. With the jackets. Um, I would skip this one too. I mean, it's super cool, but 
I don't think. And then, I don't know. I like a couple of these CDs and... What about that pot? I don't know. I don't know how much it is. Is this... It's made in Portugal. It's a copper pot. Oh. It does have a dent in it, though. Oh, I wouldn't get it. And if the inside... Mm -mm, well, it looked it. like it could be easily cleaned inside. I wouldn't get it. No? No. Okay, let's just put it in here, yeah. Yeah, it's the kitchen. And I didn't know about this, if this is anything that... Uh, yeah. Yeah, this is yeah. cool. Yeah. yeah, you're nailing this. I'm looking at it now, I'm like, I don't know if it's that special. I didn't, um, know, if, I didn't know if this stuff was, like, popular. Um, you know what, let's skip it. Okay. Let's skip it. Then I spot this leather jacket this cool chain and I, you know I, I just wasn't sure but I come back to it I put the leather coat on as a joke it's really not my style but I just thought I'd throw it on for fun this is crazy. and we're thinking we're gonna go ahead and buy it if the price is right look at this cover 1971 what etiquette of the new intimacy how to frisk, wallow, rub, etc. Um, we need to get that. Wait, and then look. I want to get the that. The etiquette of new intimacy. This is the cover story. Personal space. It's about... Look at these pictures. Frisking a woman. Wow. It's in perfect condition. Yeah, no, I think we should get it. I think it's a great collector. I know. Oh my god, I love this coat. Is it just a crazy thing? Um... No, it looks good. I mean... <laughs> That's a liner, isn't it? Is it? Is that a liner for a coat? Because I looked at it and then I put it back. It's a liner. Oh, it, it is. is a liner. People have been buying them to wear as vests, believe it or not. I know. I think it's really cool. It. I'm gonna get it. It's five dollars. Okay, I'm gonna get it. Yeah. Okay. So I'll put the forty aside. So we'll just do this first. Do you know how, oh. how much is this? A dollar. Okay. Okay. Bring a ladder. Okay. Bring it back. It's an old one. Okay. Okay. Um, how much are CDs? A dollar each. A dollar each. Wow. Um, I think I'm gonna pass on them. Oh, except for you want that one? Yeah, we'll get Dolly. All right. All right. Let's take them. Dolly Parton? Dolly. 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 We're the funniest people, um, let me tell you. They should be filling in. Are you kidding me? Um, <laughs> totally, totally correct. Though. Okay. Ten. Okay. Ten? Yes. Okay. okay. It's uranium buzz, right? I don't know. I like it though. Sorry. Uh, Three dollars. Three dollars. And then this bag. Twenty. Twenty? Mm -hmm. It's vintage coach. Alright, I'll take it. Vintage coach. It reminds me of Weller. Oh, that's cool. Wow. I don't know. I don't think I like it. Dollar. What you just said. Good time, Charlie. You do what on it? Yeah. <laughs> no. Um, it's too big. Take some, them. Take them. <laughs> Thanks. Um, Two dollars. Okay. Let's go. Oh, okay. It just needs a spider web. Yeah, I think it's all right. Yeah. Um, oh, a pair of socks. Okay, what else do you have? For my documentary, I have a part of it. Yeah, I put that in the socks. And something that looks like her, right? <laughs> Yeah. Um, I have 15 on that. I'll do 10. 10? 10. Cremation urinals. That's okay. One because has the face on it. Okay, we'll do 10 on that. That's fine. I mean, urns. What am I calling the urinals? A dollar. Uh, a dollar. Very good. A dollar. These? Uh, and a dollar. Uh, uh, and a dollar. Right. Thank you. Thank you. Hundred bucks. Okay, that's good. Okay, and is that? Did we get these? Yeah, yeah we did. We yeah. Did. Okay. Well, you guys got yeah, lots for, of good stuff. We did get some good things. Oh. We just notice how I'm carrying everything. I mean, I don't know about that leather coat, honestly, but I just thought it was really cool, and we sold a leather coat. Yeah. Yeah. For one fifty, I yeah. think. And. 
you know, we, we bought the leather coat for 40, so I, I, I don't think we're gonna lose on that. Yeah. It was a bit of a sleeper sale. Yeah. Just because like when I went in, I was kind sleeper of like- Sleeper sale. <laughs> you like that? Yeah. Sleeper sale, maybe uh -huh. that's the title of the video. Yeah, sleeper um, sale. You know, I, cause it looked like things were really picked over. Yeah. But then when you started looking, like I well, was in the kitchen. that's why I spent so long upstairs in the attic, even though I only came out with like two things. But I thought he was going to like lock you in there. He got heckling us the whole freaking time. Oh my God. That was really difficult. He was like really, I thought he was that's heckling why you me for recording. Me to... and, <laughs> and then he was like, someone broke it and he was going to close it broken. The, oh, the, the door? The, the, oh my God. Is the that ladder. when you started? So I was like, Melissa, I really think you should come down. I mean... I just was like, this, I could see this ending not well, but it was fine. You didn't get locked in there. No. You know, it's we should one. get going because we've got to go to the okay. storage unit. All right. We've got to pick things up and then we've got the chimney sweeps coming. So. Oh, okay. All right. Well, then this is where we're going to say goodbye. Thanks for coming along. Thanks. See you next time.